Hello, welcome back. Today I have got an awesome video to share with you guys. We have got another tool, so which is um, it is called LiRen, and it is similar to BootRen as well. But this one it is much smaller, and you can run CheckRen and run Linux directly from your USB hard drive uh, without install Linux into your PC, so it doesn't affect your computer data. For this tool, it is quite simple. It doesn't have a lot of steps, so you just follow me some few steps. And now let's get started. So first of all, you need um, the USB hard drive. And for me, I am going to use um, the 8GB um, USB hard drive. And if you have 2GB or you have 4GB USB hard drive, it does work as well. Don't worry about it. Because Lyran it is very small, only 200 megabyte. So you can download from the link in the description. I also include it as well. So you will need um, Lyran and then you will need Rufus and it. This tool allows you to create bootable USB and if this tool doesn't work, you can use Balena software. I also include the link in the description as well. So now you can plug in your USB into your computer. After that, you can right click on Rufus and then you will need to run it as administrator. I'm gonna go to no, I don't want to check for update. So it will detect your USB hard drive and then you can select the ISO file and you will need to pick the um, Lyran that we have just download and for me I have placed it on the desktop I can go to desktop and then I can click on Lyran and then I can click on open for all of these options you don't need to touch it so just leave it at just leave it as default and then you can click on start and make sure your computer is connected to the internet as well because um, it has to download some important file and then click on yes and it will download some file and after download it will ask you to erase everything from your USB hard drive so make sure you don't have um, any important file from your USB hard drive because we need to erase everything from it and finally click on ok but for me I have already done this one so I don't need to click on ok so because I, I did it before, I create the bootable USB before, so I don't need to do that. Alright, after that, you will need to restart your computer. But I'm not going to use this one, I'm going to use um, another PC. I have the HP one. Alright, now I have got um, the HP computer. So in order to boot into the USB, you need to go to boot device option. And if you have different computer, you need to figure it out which key that you need to go to BIOS. And then you can start to run from USB. So for me, I'm gonna press on F9. And then it will go to boot device option on my PC. So I just um, navigate to my USB one. This is my USB hard drive. And hit on enter. Now it will boot into Lyran, as you can see. Now you are on desktop and you will see the CheckRen logo and all you have to do you can click on start here and it has the arrow to show you that um, you need to click on this one so we can click on it and on run you will see the command here so just type CheckRen and then hit on enter and you will see um, check ran pop up as you can see and all you have to do just plug in your iPhone into your computer and have the iPhone SE running on iOS 13.3 and you can plug in and you will see the pop-up message and 
make sure you trust otherwise it doesn't recognize by your computer so you need to trust um, on your iPhone click on trust and now um, it is recognized so all you have to do you can navigate by using um, the arrow key um, on your keyboard so I can click on start and click on next to put my iPhone into recovery mode and now my iPhone is entering recovery mode and it seems to be working perfectly fine and we can start and by following some the and you need to follow some of the physical button here in order to jailbreak your iPhone so you can hit on enter to start and my iPhone is in um, TFU mode and it is successfully jailbreak you can see and all you have to do you just wait for your device to boot up If you see the error, it is okay, and you will see um, check ran pop up, and I have check ran here. You can click on it, and you will need to connect to the internet in, in order to install Sidea. So you can click on um, Sidea to install. But for me, this one I have already jailbroken using um, bootran and I using check ran on Linux. So that's why I have um, Sidea on my home screen. So finally. I hope you like this video and I hope um, this method is working for you as well. If you have any question, you can comment down below and I will try to answer as much as possible.